Hello and welcome back to SRB Gaming. Today is my uh, interpretation of the asteroid redirect mission by NASA in uh, Kerbal Space Program Real Solar System. Now I was originally doing this in this the stock game but I thought that was a little too easy so I decided to do it in Real Solar System. What you're seeing at the beginning is the uh, ARM, ARM, asteroid redirect mission, the ARM probe grabbing a class A asteroid, so a small one just a couple meters across, and uh, after attached it will be bringing it into a stable high orbit around the moon. This is the goal of the uh, asteroid redirect mission which if approved will go through in the next couple of years. The um, While the actual propulsion methods, ships, even the location of the initial asteroid, it was already in a high orbit around Earth, are going to be different than the real life ones but the concept of bringing it around the moon and then bringing uh, astronauts to visit it will be the same. So we're using near future propulsion for the probe, and uh, I included pretty much the entire mission here, so uh, sorry if it's a bit long, but I heard that you guys wanted to see this, so uh, if you think that I should include less, let me know. Anyway, the asteroid's very small, so it doesn't add that much mass to the actual ship. The real asteroid redirect mission would be using a near-Earth asteroid, but it would not be using one that's in orbit around the Earth because there are no asteroids in orbit around the Earth. And uh, what I did was just wait until a Class A got captured just by a uh, normal time warping. So uh, due to the Moon's inclination, it was a bit difficult to bring the asteroid back, but eventually I did, and I still had plenty of fuel. So what you'll see in the second part of the video is sending one Kerbal, or astronaut, to the uh, asteroid. And the real one would use the Orion capsule, which holds four. It would be using the SLS launch system. Uh, that's redundant. Space launch system, launch system, SLS rocket. How about that? <laughs> anyway, and uh, that would be, again, going to the moon and achieving orbit and visiting the asteroid. And the astronauts would then take samples and do studies on it. But, um, so. This one is just using a Mark I lander capsule. We've got monopropellant propulsion system at the very end to get it back to Earth, and uh, near future Vasmir to get it up. Not very realistic in that, as in that's definitely not what they're going to be using, but this is what I wanted to use for my purposes. So the uh, manned ship flies to the moon, which is a bit difficult because of the inclination, but we're not planning to land on it, just get there. And after achieving a high orbit, Jebediah brings his ship in for the encounter and has to match planes and that is um the encounter was a bit difficult because you'll see when you get when he gets close to the asteroid there are some problems I keep missing it the center of mass is now in the probe so I accidentally target that eventually I just attached the transfer stage which spun off into oblivion and is still in orbit around the moon and uh just used the little habitation stage just to maneuver into the asteroid and then it was pretty a, a much simpler to attach. So once I'd done that, Jebediah gets out and takes a surf, surf, surface sample of the asteroid, explores around with his lights, and then checks out the uh, ARM asteroid redirect probe because yeah, wouldn't that be cool to see a probe that no one ever expected to ever see again, that no other person would ever see again because it's floating in space. That would be pretty cool. So uh, Jeb does that and then gets back into his ship and uh, getting back from the moon was quite easy. It was a pretty cheap burn and then just an easy retrograde burn to re-enter the atmosphere. Now uh, this is the asteroid redirect mission is meant to be part of the Orion's line of missions. There are some people who are opposed to it just because it's uh, there are two sides to this. Some people think it's wasteful, other people think it's a good step. I think it, anything that is new is good, honestly. So uh, I hope they go through with this. Although, yeah, they kind of need more funding anyway. Anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the asteroid redirect mission playthrough. And uh, I will be going to Siri soon, in case you were wondering. Some of you commented. And I'm also planning to go to an asteroid, giant asteroid in the belt called Psyche, which was recommended to be by a user on Reddit, which is uh, a 100% iron and nickel asteroid. So, and it's it's big. 
So that should be interesting. That'll be added to the expansion pack as well. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Subscribe for more.